Science. Last February, Emily Whitehead was a very ill seven-year-old. She'd been diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia and standard treatments had failed. Her parents took her to Philadelphia where doctors were trying out a new pediatric leukemia treatment using an unlikely ally, a modified form of HIV. We were down to 48 hours of making a decision or she could start to have organ failure. and uh, So we didn't sleep for a couple days and, um, and we ended up here. With the help of a genetically altered HIV stripped of the devastating properties that cause AIDS, doctors turned Emily's own immune cells into cancer-fighting cells. But to start with, the bioengineered cells worked too well and her immune system became overactive, causing a relapse. They took us out in the hall and said, there is no room to get sicker. She is as sick as you can get. You know, they said, you, you should call your family in. Um, there's a pretty good chance you won't be here in the morning. But happily, doctors were able to control the side effects with drugs, and Emily pulled through. <laughs> we checked her three months and now six months out from her treatment. She has no disease whatsoever. She's going to school. She tells me that she feels perfectly fine. So she really has benefited very significantly from the T-cell treatment. She would like play with me. Although doctors are stressing this is early days as far as the treatment is concerned, yeah. Emily's family is delighted and is looking forward to their first Christmas together at home in two years.